Hey, welcome to Pieces of Love Tarot, and I am Honey. I will be doing your full moon and Libra reading. We're going to see what sign it's for. Let's just... I'm just going to turn my head down and just grab a card, okay? This is... Full moon in Libra for the air signs. And actually, Libra is an air sign, so okay. Um, air signs are Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius. So this will be a full moon in Libra reading for Gemini's, Sun Moon, and or rising, or if you have Gemini in any um, part of your chart. Libra, the same as well, and Aquarius. All air signs, sun, moon, rising, or any, um, or if an air sign falls in any part of your chart, this reading is for you. Or if you so happen to click on this reading, then this might resonate with you as well. And for all, take what resonates with you and leave the rest. All right. <clears throat> Spirit guides, angels, and ancestors, please lead us, guides, and bless us in this full moon and Libra reading for our air signs. Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius. opportunities um, being laid out for you so um, could just say if you've been going through something a bunch of doors have been being closed in your face or a door has been closed in your face then um, a bunch of doors are being opened for you around this full moon and Libra time uh, if you are single, then a bunch of love interests could be coming your way in this full moon in Libra. Excuse that my heat just kicked on. We're going to continue. I'll try to speak up a little bit. Uh, as far as opportunities, business opportunities, so lots of proposals coming your way, opportunities, um, and as far as dating, you know, dating opportunities. If you are in a relationship, this could mean that you are, you guys are setting boundaries in your relationship. Um, learning how to compromise more as well in your relationship. Seeing things uh, balance. Um, Libra is about balance. So it could be coming to a more balance in your relationship as well. We have the two, four, six, 
a nine of pentacles for you, air sign. So with all these <clears throat> different opportunities that are coming your way, um, it will be bringing in lots of money, lots of good fortune your way, whatever you choose. So basically with this card I'm getting at, you're going to be choosing the right option for you. Sometimes, well let's not, we shouldn't really talk about it, but sometimes this is, with this card it can be judgment a little bit cloudy, but I'm not getting that in this situation for you air signs. Um, if anything, I'm getting clarity and um, balance, stability, okay? And although you're an air sign, I'm hearing the word grounded, so maybe you want to do some grounding or maybe invest in some um, crystals that um, help ground you. I'm just getting the word grounding. We'll do one more. divinely guided. That's why um, when I was just talking about clarity. So again, you see like that light looking around the hand. And so you see as this biggest opportunity um, possibly. Then I was also talking about grounding earth energy. So that's a stick root. Think about rooted. Um, so the decision that you're making you made the right decision basically you're being divinely guided in your decision making so in other words clarity I'm just really getting clarity big well third eye as well I got third eye so these kind of look like eyes, but so right now maybe your eyes are on your pentacles right now. Uh, you look at this lady, she looks like she has her money together, her finances together, her pentacles, these are her pentacles together, so that could be your focus right now. Okay, another keyword for you is focus. Yes, clarity, focus. Third eye, mm -hmm. rooted, grounded. So, air signs, uh, that's your full moon and Libra reading. So, the air signs are June 9, Libra, and Aquarius. I hope that you enjoyed this video and I hope to see you back again soon. Thank you so much for watching.